It's the radio guy, Dr. Mike France. Got a basketball update for you on from the men and the women's side of things. For the Purdue View A&M University Panthers, the Panthers go on the road to San Antonio, Texas to take on University of Texas at San Antonio. The Roadrunners victorious over the Panthers by the score of 82 to 75. Panthers played tough, couldn't quite overcome an early deficit, but as a result, the Panthers come up short, but they were able to represent the conference and PV Nation quite well. Meanwhile, on the women's side of things, women took place with the Jarvis Christian Bulldogs on Monday, and they were victorious over Jarvis Christian by the score of 100 to 66. We were able to catch up with Coach Sandy Pugh and get her feedback on how the Panthers performed. We played hard, didn't always do the best job defensively, but overall, anytime I guess you could score 100 points, it wasn't a bad evening. Um, Jarvis came, definitely came in and played hard. Those ladies are going to have a good year. Um, uh, they were able to get to the free throw line uh, on some miscues from us defensively. Uh, but all in all, it was a good night. I got, had a chance to play everyone and uh, some kids at the end of the bench who didn't get a, you know normally get an opportunity to, to uh, you know, be in that limelight, had a chance to, you know, get in the game and do some great things. Jaleel Harper. Uh, was one. I mean, she was out there doing her thing and looked great doing it. Diana um, was was spectacular tonight. KP found her rhythm, which we desperately need going into uh, down this back stretch as we hit the road coming up next week. So all in all, I, I would say, you know, they came in um, and they battled and, you know, they fought through a lot of adversity. But um, it was a good night. We got a chance to sign some posters, meet some fans. Um, you know, take some pictures. So it was a good night. And to all the Panthers out there in Panther land, I want to wish you a, a phenomenal Thanksgiving with your family, friends, and loved ones. And uh, hope to see you guys in January. Of course, that was Coach Sandy Pugh giving us a recap of the Panthers' victory over Jarvis Christian Bulldogs, as we mentioned, 100 to 66. The Panthers still have a few more non-conference games to get under their belts before we tip off into conference play in January. Reminding you that you can stay tuned here at the Open Mic Broadcast Network for the latest and the greatest going on throughout Panther sports and the Southwestern Athletic Conference. I am going to exit stage left for right now. I want to remind you guys that it is always a joy and a pleasure to bring you these updates, these interviews on a daily basis. Follow me on Twitter at the Mike Prince Show. The YouTube channel is the Open Mic Broadcast Network. Don't forget, you can always ask your smart device on playing the latest episode for the Mike Prince Show. We got a lot more interviews coming up for you on this week. We're going to hear about the FAMU disappointment on the football side of things, but the victory on the volleyball side of things. Hear from Coach Bubba McDowell and a whole lot more. I am going to exit stage left for right now. I am the radio guy, Dr. Mike Prince. Thank you guys so much for joining in with us. And until the next time, you guys be blessed and we'll see you on the other side.